guys, so um, we want to tell you about a story that just happened at school. So there's this game, as you you know those, if you go check out the Here, Frozen Bra Challenge, it? wait, oh. if you go check out the Frozen Bra Challenge, you'll know who this person is, her name is Sadie. Here, let me, can I explain the, the hat one? Yeah. So here's what happened, I was walking out, so this is at school, this happened This is school. a game that um, right, her and right. Sadie have. Yeah, so it's kind of like a game, not really, though. It's just, like, a dirty game or something like that. So instead of, like, hitting each other or something like that, they, we, what they I did was hat. she did something. She took my boot, right? So, and she hit it. So I found the boot, I put it back on, and it took her hat, right? And then she grabbed my hat off my head, and she, I gave her back her hat. She threw mine, and I grabbed it, right? Like, she didn't purposely throw it on the ground or anything. She went running, and we both, me and George both ran after her and tried to get the hat back. Didn't end up working good, so we just left and had our hat on. We walked, like, around the school corner, and, and then Sadie comes up behind me, grabs my hat, and throws it back to me, almost like the ground. She caught it, though. I caught it, and I go darting after her, right? And, like, not to be mean or anything. I didn't slam her against, yeah, I, okay. I she pushed her, her against the wall. The wall. And then... Yeah, this is my part of the story now. So... Um, and then there's So I'm not this, focusing, I'm still talking to Sadie when this is happening. Yeah. And stuff, right? So there's this huge group of fourth graders coming there's like five of them. Five, like only two so of them were involved with this, but there was five people, which is what made it so it's hard for me to see. the connection with uh, your friend. Yeah. Too. Oh, so my best friend, Claire, um, her neighbor is um this kid named Harlow and he she has a little brother. Um, I don't so, know, we don't know the brother's name. I hate them. And they're so rude all the time. So, I, you know, I remember these kids are, like, so little, so they're little yeah. twerps, obviously. Yeah. So her brother was, com- um, the neighbor's brother, Harlow, br- her brother was coming out with his friends, and me and Tegan were over there talking about, with Sadie, Sadie and stuff. stuff. She so was over by her out. siblings and yeah. stuff like that. So they come out, and we're, lo- and we're just standing there. We're still there. talking about the yeah. hat and stuff like that. So we're just I'm standing like, there talking and stuff. And joking around. We're laughing, yeah. but we're not, like... And there's this, that kid comes up comes over and he like trips me and then this other kid stands on both of my feet so I didn't I couldn't catch my balance and I fell backwards and Tegan caught me and then um pushed me a little bit and stepped back and then I fell on the ground like I did but the thing is I didn't know I was catching her like somehow like my brain like I wasn't focusing I was just focusing on the the person who like tripped her but like no, I didn't you were focusing, focusing on, on Sadie. Sadie I still was I didn't even know that that this was happening yeah I so, guess I caught you by accident and yeah. I was still talking and just like back up because yeah I thought you like just did a trip right yeah and she ended up falling like butt first on the yeah ground, so like, I butt like, first wet butt yeah I'm soaking wet and so and then this kid says you just tripped me what's wrong with you and I'm just like seriously so what happened was okay well she was still on the ground this sounds really mean, but I spit in the kid's face and I slapped it with my toque. And then, so, then I got up and I was really angry and I kicked the kid. I attempted to kick him in the balls, but it didn't work. I kicked him in the shin. And then me and Tegan were walking away while I was wipe- wiping the wet dirt off my <laughs> ass. But she walked away with, like, <laughs> dirt grains on her ass. Like, I'm not joking. Um, so we were walking away, we were talking about, like, how dumb that kid is and how we're gonna, like, end up jumping it maybe one day, like... We're gonna like go on Monday and like whip that kid. It's I Friday right now. Yeah, and if and so we were walking away right, and then this that kid runs Comes up running, behind darting, us. like just taps her. I'm pretty sure. No, he's just like that. He yeah. was trying to do something. I don't know what he did. And we both and, turned around like and he sprinted away. He was so scared. He was like ah oh, and just left right. Yeah. So. Again, this kid's, like, so tiny. I know it seems kind of pathetic, but then she got tripped by that tiny of a kid. But, like, she was doing something else at that time, and she... I don't know how it's really hard to explain, but... But the one kid wasn't so small. I should have said, I know where he lives. Because I know where he lives. You should have yelled it out when he was running away. Oh my gosh, guys, that was actually so crazy. Don't that is there. the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed our story time comment about down that below. ass of a kid. I know. Comment down below. Like, if you can't, if comments are turned off, go check out our our uh, Instagram. We'll put it right here and um, comment. It'll on be in that. the description too. The link will be in the descrip- description for Instagram. I don't know mm-hmm. why I keep on doing that, but whatever. Okay, so we will see. You. Also, comment down below if you have ever been jumped before, caused a jump, or maybe even had some beef with somebody. Whatever. Okay, so we'll see you in our next vlog. Peace out.